Hello everybody, my name is Frank Kutsakria and we are five and a half months away from the November elections and we are about three months away from the major party conventions. But will they take place and will they take place on site? Like and subscribe, hate and comment. I'm going to tell you why both parties are going to have a different opinion on those answers. So let's start with why we are here. We know it's the global pandemic that's out there. Um, states are opening up uh, slowly, not as quickly as some of us would want. Some much faster than others, right? Um, Democrats are going to have an incentive to not have an in-person convention. And it is partially to bring up the fact that the handling of this crisis has been anything but awesome and they want to blame it on the president. The best way to do that is to say that you really can't get together and do a convention in Milwaukee in time uh, to adequately protect the delegates and alternates and the press and the nominee and the nominee's vice presidential nominee uh, adequately and safely. That's all garbage. I mean, look. The whole point of putting the economy into a coma was what we were told was to flatten the curve, not eradicate the virus. And uh, a little bit of uh, sober coffee here, people. The virus will not be gone in three months. There will not be a vaccine in three months. There may never be a vaccine. We don't have a vaccine for Zika. We don't have a vaccine for MERS. SARS dissipated. We didn't get a vaccine for it. Spanish flu, Hong Kong flu, uh, norovirus, black plague. We don't have a vaccine for it. We don't have a vaccine for AIDS. Why do you think we're going to get a vaccine for COVID-19? Because people are trying to find one? We got a vaccine for smallpox because some farmers figured out that farmers don't get smallpox. We have a vaccine for polio because Jonas Salt like discovered it by accident. We are not gonna get a vaccine for COVID-19 by the election. Nowhere are we gonna get it by these conventions. Uh, but new cases are dropping every day. And, um, but there's a tremendous expense trying to put together these conventions. And we already know who the nominee is. It's Joe Biden. We already know who the vice presidential nominee is. He doesn't know who it is yet, but whoever it is is going to be just picking. They're not going to, they're not going to be a formal vote. Okay. This isn't 1972. Okay. There's no formal vote that's going to happen. You know, other than yes, we agree with your point. So... What's the point of having these conventions, right? It's a big rah, rah, rah. Well, these are all television events. Really, it's only the last two hours of the night anyways. Um, you know, you'll, they'll have Joe Biden go to Miller Field, maybe. Um, or Miller Park. I don't know what they call it in Milwaukee. Uh, with a handful of people talk about how President Trump screwed up. Um, and then on the other foot, a week later, in Charlotte, the Republicans will have an incentive to have all of their delegates and alternates show up, even if it's too expensive, even if it makes no economic sense, even if you know Donald Trump's going to be the nominee, and Mike Pence is going to be the vice president nominee, because for them, it's going to be about showing strength. It's about how we've overcome this virus, even though there is going to be no vaccine. So Democrats can yell for a week and say that they're not doing social distancing and that they don't care about the people. And Republicans can yell at Democrats for the week and say that they don't care about business moving forward. They don't care about the seamstresses, the, the ball gown people, the, the bars, the restaurants, the whorehouse. They may want to avoid the whorehouses, but they will not mention, oh, they will mention, the Democrats don't care about the small businessman. 
And the Democrats get to yell at Republicans and say, they don't care about you because they're trying to keep you unsafe. So, yes. The Republicans will have their convention in person. The Democrats will not. Like and subscribe, hate, comment. I'll see you later on.